original hipster gyro. Original hipster from the spirals of time. So, here we are again, another Joyra game against Mogus, God of Slaughter, and my old buddy Carlos Potatoes Valdez. It's kind of a cool name. I like you, Carlos Potatoes Valdez, I sure do. We're going to keep this hand because Wayfarer's Bauble and Dak Faden are both guaranteed coming down. Also, Repeal's pretty relevant, and Joyra is coming down too. My opponent's ball getting to five. Uh oh, this might be over already. No, he's keeping his hand. Talking about Blood Crypt. What? Talking about Blood Crypt. What? We got a Blood Crypt, baby. In a Wayfarer bubble saying hey, hello. Alright. So next turn, we got the mountain, we got the bobble, we got another highland coming on down. Want my friend over here to play an artifact, because I will steal it. Steal it so goddamn fast. Ooh, the cascade bluffs. Now nah, I still think I play the mountain. Um, do I do this now? Sure, why not? Uh, island, you're in to play. So we have Cryptic now as well. That's sweet. We love Cryptic, don't we, friends? Oh, we sure do. My opponent moving right along, not missing any mana drops. I like to see that. I like to see that quite a bit in games. You know what? It's Jora instead of Dak Faden. Because then I could send up Inkwell, Leviathan the next turn, and possibly even Dak Faden, depending on what I get. Now, he may have the removals. Oh, he does. poop de doop de pants Why? Why? Cruel, cruel fates. Why have you done this to me? I ain't done nothing wrong. I ain't done nothing wrong. Oh, well. Yeah, in hindsight, Dag Faden was definitely the move there. I mean, he's red black with five cards in his hands. How how what world would we live in in which he did not have the removal, you know? It's too bad repeal isn't non land is non land permanent, because I would like to do it. I gotta play the Thurian Dynamo here. I got to so that's the end of my turn, but we're in good shape for the future times. We have seven mana now. That's enough for a Flame Blast Dragon. Red spells cast, cost <laughs> one less to play. Draw all the cards of the live long day. That's going to get annoying, huh? It's alright, it's alright, we're good, we're good. I'm gonna steal this with old Daki Fei Fei. And then what? And then just keep repeal up, I guess. Hee <laughs> hee, thank you! <laughs> Or I can actually play Flame Blast Dragon now, right? Cool. Nice. Thanks, Ruby Medallion. You're the best. Love that Ruby Medallion. <laughs> nice. So now he's got to have removal for the Flame Blast Dragon, and he's got to try to kill the Dak Faden as well. So he stops stealing his artifacts. He'll pro he probably will have removal for the Flame Blast Dragon. I'm fairly certain he will. Red, black, how could you not? So, Jor is actually only going to cost four, I believe. And then that's enough to send up the Inkwell Leviathan and leave up a repeal, sort of, a repeal for something tiny. Wrecking Ball! Well, he was bound to have it. Alright, first things first, 
Well, I am going to play this island, but wait, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Well, shit. We are definitely playing this bastard. And then we'll plus one. All right, drawn two, discarding two. I think we're going to discard clock spinning. I definitely don't think I'll need that. Ugh, strip mine will be really good against that swamp. I gotta keep it. Ugh, I have to. So, oh, Jesus. Ancestral vision, is that correct? That seems so bad, but we're gonna do it. I think repeal will be more relevant than waiting three turns and drawing some cards. I think I'll need repeal sooner rather than later, so that's why I did that. But it was tough. It was a difficult decision, and I'm not entirely convinced it was correct. Three damage. Oh, so there goes Dak. <laughs> Dak, you did a good job. You drew me a couple cards. You stole a ruby medallion. I'm cool with you, bro. Um, I want that strip mine. We, yeah, this, this thing will win him the game eventually. So I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Blightning. No one ever suspects the blightning. Fuck you. Underworld corruption. So, you know, those who watch me, you guys know I don't often do a, do a, the old land destruction. It's very rare, and I felt bad doing it because you only had five land, but that thing is insane, and I can't let that, I can't let that happen. Surely you understand. Well, go ahead and try doing blightning on me now, buddy. What can you do? Oh no. So I think we win this game. Uh, not without some dirty tactics. Strip mining that swamp. But I had to do it. I had to do it. I can have a guilty conscience, but I'll also have a win. So I'll take it. Right? What can he do? I got two shroud guys. Nothing in my hand. Oh, that guy's actually pretty good. Well, fuck. <laughs> Damn it. That's actually, that's actually pretty good. Time bug! Alright. <laughs> that sucks. I can't do anything now. Ugh. Damn it! Yeah, I'm not gonna trade Inkwell Leviathan for Vampire Nighthawk. Okay, well, good job, friend. <laughs> that's what I get for speaking out of turn like that. Come on, play an island. <laughs> Play an island! Why don't you, Mogus? I heard you were dabbling in the blue affairs, no? Well, alright. What are you gonna do, kill my time bug? That's a pretty damn good one. I don't need you time crafting. Son of a bitch. I'm, I might actually lose now. Oh, one more turn. One more turn. Oh, no, 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 no. What? No, he's got Shroud. Okay, so he can't be taking Inkwell Leviathan. I got really scared for a second there. He's going to take either the Lightning Greaves or my Thran Dynamo. Probably my Thran Dynamo. That'd really help him out. Plastic cactus, you need to learn how to shut your stupid mouth. Don't you know that when you start start flapping your guns, he plays Vampire Nighthawk and then Aladdin? <laughs> you with all the artifacts in the world? Son of a bitch. Ugh. Oh, it hurts us. I'm over there counting all my chickens before they hatch. Every one of my chickens, they're all counted. Ugh, god damn it. If I get another big thing, I'll trade the Inkwell Leviathan. Instead, I get a mountain. That's what I get instead. You horse cock. You horse cock. Oh, that ancestral vision would look pretty good right about now, huh? Ugh, I guess not over strip mine. 
Since I was only keeping one of them, Strip Mine was still the choice, so he's not drawing 8,000 cards. Not that he needs them yet, all his good cards. Ruby Medallion, goodbye. Or Lighting Greaves, sure. Lightning Greaves and then kill Joyra? Give me something to do with my mana. <laughs> I can't even fucking believe this. I'm gonna get taken out by a vampire Nighthawk? Oh. oh, it's so gross. I gotta start attacking soon. Just let me get one more relevant thing. One more relevant thing before I trade my Inkwell Leviathan for this terrible creature. Oh, good. Greed. So he's getting the cards anyway. I'll take it. I will take it. Get the fuck out of here. Screw you, Vampire Nighthawk. Ooh. Bottom, bottom. I don't want that artifact killer. So now we go in for all this. All of this. It makes his greed worse because he's getting lower on life. So that's nice. He cannot rack those key rune. But he can incinerate Joyra. Ah, uh, it's okay with me. You go ahead and incinerate Joyra. Now I can do something next turn. Still not out of the woods yet. There's a number of things that he could get. That would be quite good. Quite good indeed. Not my time, bug. I gotta be able to kill Aladdin. Aladdin, you're breaking my balls. Mogus, Mogus, let's not blow this. Mogus, Mogus, let's go now. Some kind of, uh... Fireball effect. That would be useful. I think I have, like, two or three of those. Don't actually target the creatures. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll take good damage. I do not want to sacrifice a creature. Oh, just an island. That's okay, because we're just playing Joyra anyway. I overpaid because the Ruby Medallion. All right, Inkwell. Hit that guy for seven. Boom, shakalaka. Go ahead and greed yourself. You are on a two-turn clock with Inkwell Leviathan, and he's got the Tramplies too, which is quite nice. I need to start drawing a little better. Not that I am scoffing the drawing of the Spin Into Myth, but I'm getting an awful lot of mana. And, oh, shit. Krenko, mob boss. Damn. Uh, and Mogus is online now, too. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. So, I guess Joyra gets in front of Mogus, I think, or she gets Searing Speared. <laughs> yes, go to the command zone. Well, uh, I th with the Trample, I keep going in with the Inkwell Leviathan, I'm pretty sure. Timecrafting, you've never been more useless. I am a little worried. This thing needs to hit me three times. And then it's over. Okay, he's not attacking. That's nice. No sacrifices. Capsize! Oh, you lovely creature! Uh, let's do it better. Control Z. Let's tap these manas better. One, two, three, one, two, three, 
cast with buyback. Uh, we'll just do Mogus right now. It would be great if I could do Lightning Greaves and then, you know, him and then I get the Thran Dynamo, but that's not going to work right now. So we'll do Mogus. So he's got less blocky poos. Yep, still getting hit for six. That's still quite a bit. Or five, rather. And uh, that could have bought him a little bit of time. If I get one more land, that would be nice too, because I can draw, I can get rid of two things. Yeah, but he's making a goblin. That's not going to really do him a lot of good. Rakdos Key Rune also not going to do him a lot of good because it's only one toughness. And I got the tramp, please. He's got a lot of mana. That makes me a little nervous. So there's Mogus. Um, I can always bounce him again, unless he gives him the Lightning Greaves, in which case, whatever, I bounce Aladdin, and then I can get my Thrant Dynamo back and bounce everything else. But I don't think he's going to do that. Destroy target non-basic land. Okay, that's just my Cascade Bluffs, and that's it. All right, all right, we're looking pretty good. Yes, I will take two damage. I will do it. Mana Crypt. Sweet. That's precisely what I'm looking for. I can capsize twice if I really want to. Four, five, six. But I don't think I need to. I think even just doing this is really quite good. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Going down to one. You have plans for this Inkwell Leviathan, do you? Huh. That's not going to do it. Three, four, five, six is not enough to block the seven. And he'd have to throw everything. So he'd have to throw the key rune and all of this in front of the Inkwell Leviathan to not die. That doesn't seem like it's going to happen. And if he taps Aladdin to get the Mana Crypt, that's fine too. Then Aladdin's tapped. And he has to pay three to do it. And if he plays Mogus, that's just getting capsized. So I think it's safe to say that I have this one in the bag. Is it safe to say, though? I don't know. The last time I was flapping my gums, everything went south. But anyway, in Inkwell Leviathan over here, he's an MVP of the deck. He's been great. Done a lot of good work with old Inkwell over here. A lot of good work indeed. Not just in this game too, but in others. He's such a good beater. And that Shroud is so relevant in Commander. Especially against the black or red deck. Such as the Mogus. Oh, it is over. Excellent. Well, that's going to do it for me this week. What a good time you and I had together. I hope you enjoyed this journey of self-discovery and wonder. Until next week, I'm Plastic Cactus, saying nothing at all, because nothing is left to be said. She keeps it classic, standards are no-no. She keeps it vintage as a matter of fact. She thinks your music is just sorta of so-so. She has a preference, but you probably never heard of that. Reject your disbelief, my friend. Better yet, why don't you suspend original hipster gyro? Original hipster from the spirals of time. Original hipster gyro. In just four turns, she'll start a victory climb.